Okay, I was looking for a new drill, basically one with a chuck. And I also wanted it to be a hammer drill, just in case I needed it to use it as a hammer drill. So I got this Bauer 7.5 amp, half inch reversible hammer drill from Harbor Freight. And I paid $33.99 for it. There, it's normally $39.99, but there was a 15% coupon on January 15th, which is today. And I used that coupon and picked this up. And it looks like it's a really good quality device. So it has this rod that allows you to adjust the distance the bit is from the wall, let's say. It's got a handle. This material looks like it's really strong and sturdy too as well. So you got that, you got your drill, which is a pretty hefty drill. This is what the drill looks like, basically. It's got a really heavy duty half inch chuck and it's got the chuck key here. And I'm gonna show you in a second here, me drilling through a concrete block with a quarter inch bit. I'm going to use the drill and I'm going to use the hammer and I'll show you the difference. Now here I got a concrete bit in there. It's nothing special. It's one of the cheaper ones, but you know, I've had it for years and it seems to work fine. Got the handle on here and the, the guide. We'll drill through a concrete brick and I'll show you how it works. Okay, I'll try to get this into the frame. On the top here, you could switch between hammer and drill alone. And I have hammer and drill set right now. And I'll show you how easy it is to go through this concrete block. I already did a couple of holes prior to this. Hopefully we get a good shot on the camera. Let's see. Yeah, that should work. Let me adjust it a little bit, maybe. All right, here we go. Switch it now to just drill mode and show you the difference. It takes slightly longer, but it does do the job even in drill mode. Now, I've had other drills before like this hammer drill. I've had like Sears. Craftsman one and it lasted only a little bit of time before it burnt out, but I was also drilling a lot of holes I'm hoping that the seven seven and a half amp one will last longer Now it has a lock here so you can lock it turned on and it has a forward and reverse And it does have that switch to switch between hammer mode and drill mode only and at a half inch, I'm, I'm pretty satisfied that that'll be able to handle almost all the bits that I ever need to do. And for $33.99, I don't think you could go wrong with it. Now, granted, this isn't a long-term review. It's just, just basically a quick review to show you the device. But this looks like a really nice device for the money.